it is confirmatory test of urea. So I would like to mention that it is a very beautiful test. So here we will observe first pink color, then violet, and then finally a blue color is obtained. Okay, so something like this. So here we will see a pink color and a violet green and a blue color. Okay. Now we will do this performance on table. So now we are moving towards the confirmatory test of our urea. For this take a clean and dry test tube. In it add pinch of our compound. So with the help of spatula take pinch of our compound in this clean and dry test tube. Then we have to heat it till white PPT is formed. So heating this compound till a white PPT is formed and with safety precautions always use the wire gauge while heating. Now add distilled water in it that is 2 ml of distilled water to dissolve this PPT. Okay. Now shake it so that this white PPT gets completely dissolved. Now add 1 ml of dilute sodium hydroxide in it. This is sodium hydroxide dilute and now we are going to add it. Okay. And then our next step is to add dilute copper sulphate solution. This is our dilute copper sulphate solution and add it in a drop wise manner slowly oh yes really here we see that chemistry is really beautiful and here we can deeply observe that a combination of pink violet and then blue color is formed okay so this confirms this beautiful test confirms the presence of urea in our compound really chemistry is very beautiful so here we will see a beautiful combination of three colors blue color followed by violet color and then pink color also so this test is really very beautiful and it confirms the presence of urea in our compound.